always in our hearts. Hollywood mourned the loss of icons such as Betty White and John Madden in the final days of 2021. And unfortunately, 2022 also brought celebrity deaths that left fans reeling. In today's video, let's remember the stars we've lost in 2022. If you want to learn who all of these famous American actors who died in 2022 are, you'll have to watch the video until the very end. Max Julian American actor Max Julian was best known for his role as Goldie in the 1973 black exploitation film The Mac. He also appeared in Restore, The Savage Seven, and Getting Straight. Max died on January 1st at age 88. Joan Copeland Actress Joan Copeland was best known for her performances in the 1977 Broadway revival of Pal Joey and her award-winning performance in the 1981 play The American Clock. Joan passed away on January 4th at the age of 99. Ray Boyle American actor Ray Boyle was best known for his role as Morgan Earp in 15 episodes of the ABC Western television series The Life and Legend of Wyatt Earp. Ray died on January 6th at the age of 98. Sidney Poitier Legendary actor Sidney Poitier was best known for his role in the 1963 film Lilies of the Field. He played the character of a handyman who helped German-speaking nuns build a chapel. In 1964, he won the Academy Award and the Golden Globe for Best Actor for this film. Sidney passed away on January 6th at the age of 94. Dwayne Hickman American actor Dwayne Hickman was best known for playing Chuck McDonald in the 1950s The Bob Cumming Show. He died on January 9th at the age of 87. Richard Fulmer Actor Richard Fulmer's work included roles in films such as Mad Money, Factory Girl, Straw Dogs, and Searching for Sunny. He passed away on January 11th at the age of 79. Carol Speed American actress and singer Carol Speed was best known for her roles as Abby Williams in the 1974 horror film Abby. She died on January 14th at the age of 76. Peter Robbins Actor Peter Robbins gained national fame in the 1960s as being the first actor to voice Charlie Brown in the Peanuts animated specials. He died on January 18th at the age of 65. Yvette Mimieu American actress Yvette Mimieu was nominated for three Golden Globe Awards during her acting career. Yvette was best known for her roles in Jackson County Jail, the Time Machine, and Skyjacked. She passed away on January 18th at the age of 80. Gloria McMillan American actress Gloria McMillan was best known for her role as Harriet Conklin on the 1950s sitcom Our Miss Brooks. She passed away on January 19th at the age of 88. Louis Anderson American actor and stand-up comedian Louis Anderson was best known for his role as Christine Baskets on the comedy television series Baskets. He also created the television sitcom The Louis Show and the cartoon series Life with Louis. He passed away on January 21st at age 68. Catherine Cates American actress Catherine Cates appeared in films and television series such as Orange is the New Black, The Many Saints of Newark, and Law and & Order Special Victims Unit. She died on January 22nd at the age of 73. Morgan Stevens American actor Morgan Stevens appeared on several television series including One Day at a Time, A Year in the Life, and Fame. He died on January 26th at the age of 70. Moses J. Mosley American actor Moses J. Mosley was known for his work on the series The Walking Dead. He died on January 26th at the age of 31. Howard Hessman American actor Howard Hessman was best known for his lead role as Charlie Moore on Head of the Class. 
Howard appeared regularly on television and in film from the 1970s to the 2010s. He passed away on January 29th at the age of 81. Carlton Carpenter American actor Carlton Carpenter was known for his roles in films such as A Periscope, The Prowler, Two Weeks with Love, and Sky Full of Moon. He died on January 31st at the age of 95. Frank Pesci American actor Frank Pesci appeared in films and television series such as Top Gun, Beverly Hills Cop, Miami Vice, Midnight Run, and Matlock. He died on February 6th at the age of 75. Lindsay Perlman American actress Lindsay Perlman was known for the television series Chicago Justice and General Hospital. She passed away on February 18th at the age of 43. Brad Johnson American actor Brad Johnson was best known for his role as Ted Baker in the 1989 fantasy drama Always. He died on February 18th at the age of 62. Leo Fong Chinese-American actor Leo Fong was best known for his roles in Murder in the Orient, Blind Rage, and Transformed. He died on February 18th at the age of 93. Sally Kellerman Actress and singer Sally Kellerman was best known for her role as Margaret Hot Lips Houlihan in M.A.S.H. She passed away on February 24th at the age of 84. Farrah Fork American actress Farrah Fork was known for her roles as Alex Lambert on the NBC sitcom Wings and Mason Drake on Lois and Clark, The New Adventures of Superman. She died on February 25th at the age of 54. Laurel Goodwin American actress Laurel Goodwin was best known for her role as Laurel Dodge in the 1962 film Girls, Girls, Girls. She died on February 25th at the age of 79. Ralph Ahn American actor Ralph Ahn was known for his roles in Eyes of an Angel, Panther, and Amityville, A New Generation. He died on February 26th at the age of 95. Ned Eisenberg Actor Ned Eisenberg was known for his role as Roger Kressler on Law & Order, Special Victims Unit. He died on February 27th at the age of 65. Johnny Brown American actor and singer Johnny Brown was best known for his role as Building Superintendent Nathan Bookman on the 1970s sitcom Good Times. He passed away on March 2nd at the age of 84. Tim Considine American actor Tim Considine was best known for his roles in the television serials My Three Sons, The Adventures of Spin and Marty, and The Hardy Boys. He died on March 3rd at the age of 81. Mitchell Ryan American actor Mitchell Ryan was best known for his roles as Burke Devlin in the 1960s gothic soap opera Dark Shadows and Edward Montgomery on Dharma and Greg. He passed away on March 4th at the age of 88. Jimmy Lydon Actor Jimmy Lydon was known for his role as Henry Aldrich in the movie series of that title. He died on March 9th at the age of 98. Emilio Delgado American actor Emilio Delgado was best known for his role as Luis on the television series Sesame Street. He died on March 10th at the age of 81. William Hurt Oscar-winning actor William Hurt was best known for his roles in Kiss of the Spider Woman, Body Heat, Children of a Lesser God, and Broadcast News. He died on March 13th at the age of 71. Scoey Mitchell American actor, writer, and TV director Scoey Mitchell was known for his work on the sitcom Barefoot in the Park. He died on March 19th at the age of 92. Catherine Hayes American actress Catherine Hayes was known for her role as Kim Hughes on the soap opera As the World Turns from 1972 to 2010. She died on March 25th at the age of 87. Valora Noland American actress Valora Noland appeared in films such as The Passionate Strangers, The War Wagon, and Beach Party. 
She passed away on March 27th at the age of 80. Barry Youngfellow American actress Barry Youngfellow was best known for her role as Jan Hoffmeyer Gray on the sitcom It's a Living. She died on March 28th at the age of 75. Paul Herman American actor Paul Herman was best known for his portrayal of club owner Peter Binsagata in The Sopranos. He also appeared in Once Upon a Time in America, Goodfellas, and The Irishman. He died on March 29th at the age of 76. Kathy Lampkin American actress Kathy Lampkin was best known for playing the Desert Air Trailer Park Manager in No Country for Old Men. She died on April 4th at the age of 74. Nehemiah Persoff American actor Nehemiah Persoff was best known for his roles as Little Bonaparte in Some Like It Hot, Reba Mandel in Yentl, and Leo in The Harder They Fall. He died on April 5th at the age of 102. Ray Allen American actress Ray Allen was best known for The Sopranos, All in the Family, and both the play and film adaptation of Damn Yankees. She passed away on April 6th at the age of 95, Rio Hackford. American film and television actor Rio Hackford was known for his role as Toby in the American drama television series Dream. He also appeared in films and TV shows such as Stay Alive, The Mandalorian, and Jonah Hex. He died on April 14th at the age of 51, James Olson. American actor James Olson appeared in The Andromeda Strain, The Strange One, The Spell, and Rachel River. He died on April 15th at the age of 91, Liz Sheridan. American actress Liz Sheridan was known for her roles as Helen in Seinfeld and the nosy neighbor Mrs. Akmonak on the sitcom Elf. She died on April 15th at the age of 93, Robert Morse. Actor Robert Morse starred in How to Succeed in Business Without Really Trying, both the 1961 original Broadway production for which he won a Tony Award and its 1967 film adaptation. He passed away on April 20th at age 90, Josara Hinaro. Brazilian-born American actress Josara Hinaro was best known for her roles in Judging Amy and ER. She died on April 27th at the age of 48, David Burney. American actor and director David Burney was best known for his role as Frank Serpico in the television series Serpico. He also appeared in St. Elsewhere and Bridget Loves Burney. He died on April 27th at the age of 83, Joanna Barnes. American actress Joanna Barnes appeared in both versions of the classic comedy The Parent Trap. In 1961, she played the role of gold digger Vicki Robinson in the original movie The Parent Trap. In the 1998 remake, she had the role of Vicki Blake, the gold digger's mother. She passed away on April 29th at age 87. Jerry Verdorn American actor Jerry Verdorn was best known for his roles as Ross Marler on Guiding Light and Clint Buchanan in One Life to Live. He passed away on May 1st at the age of 72. Andra Martin American actress Andra Martin appeared in Yellowstone Kelly, Street of Sinners, and The Lady Takes a Flyer. She died on May 3rd at the age of 86. Mike Haggerty American actor Mike Haggerty was best known for his roles as Mike, the manager of a muffler shop on HBO's Lucky Louie, and Mr. Trigger, the building superintendent on Friends. He died on May 5th at the age of 67. Bruce McVitie American actor Bruce McVitie was best known for his roles as Mickey Mack in Million Dollar Baby, Danny Scalertio in The Sopranos, and Detective Eastman in Lonely Hearts. He passed away on May 7th at the age of 65, Fred Ward. American actor and producer Fred Ward was best known for his roles in Tremors, The Player, Escape from Alcatraz, and Shortcuts. He died on May 8th at the age of 79, 
Maggie Peterson American actress Maggie Peterson was best known for her role as Charlene Darling on The Andy Griffith Show. She died on May 15th at the age of 81. John Aylward American actor John Aylward was best known for his roles as Dr. Donald Anspa on ER and Barry Goodwin on The West Wing. He died on May 16th at the age of 75. Marnie Schulenberg American actress Marnie Schulenberg was best known for her roles as Joe Sullivan on the One Life to Live reboot and as Allison Stewart on As the World Turns. She died on May 17th at the age of 37. Linda Lawson American actress Linda Lawson was best known for her turn as a mysterious mermaid in the 1961 film Night Tide. She died on May 18th at the age of 86. Ray Liotta American actor and film producer Ray Liotta was best known for his roles as Henry Hill in Martin Scorsese's Goodfellas and Shoeless Joe Jackson in Field of Dreams. He also appeared in films such as No Escape, Unlawful Entry, Copland, Blow, The Place Beyond the Pines, and Killing Them Softly. He died on May 26th at the age of 67. John Zderko American actor John Zderko appeared in films such as Gin, Apparitional, and 892. He passed away on May 26th at the age of 60. Bo Hopkins American actor Bo Hopkins was best known for his roles in films such as American Graffiti, The Wild Bunch, The Getaway, Midnight Express, and The Man Who Loved Cat Dancing. He died on May 28th at the age of 84. Janet DeGore American actress Janet DeGore appeared in The Real McCoys, 77 Sunset Strip, and Perry Mason. She died on June 11th at the age of 91. Philip Baker Hall American actor Philip Baker Hall was best known for his roles in The Truman Show, Secret Honor, Doc, Hard Eight, Magnolia, and Boogie Nights. He died on June 12th at the age of 90. James Rado American actor and director James Rado, best known as the co-author and lead actor in the iconic counterculture Broadway musical Hair, died on June 21st at the age of 90, Joe Turkle. American actor Joe Turkle, best known as the replicant maker Dr. Eldon Tyrell in Blade Runner and as Lloyd the bartender in The Shining, passed away on June 27th at the age of 94, Lenny Von Dolan. Lenny Von Dolan played Harold Smith on the hit series Twin Peaks. He also appeared in films such as Electric Dreams, Downstream, and Teeth. Lenny passed away on July 5th at the age of 63. James Kahn Oscar-winning actor James Kahn was best known for his explosive turn as Sonny Corleone in The Godfather and as a dying professional football player in Brian's Song. He died on July 6th at the age of 82. Tony Sirico Tony Sirico played the impeccably groomed mobster Polly Walnuts in The Sopranos. He also appeared in films such as Goodfellas, Mighty Aphrodite, and Everyone Says I Love You. Tony died on July 8th at the age of 79. Gregory Itson The character actor who played an Exonian president in the action thriller series 24, Gregory Itson passed away on July 8th at the age of 74. Larry Storch Larry Storch, best known as bumbling Corporal Randolph Algarin on the 1960s sitcom F Troop, died on July 8th at the age of 99. L.Q. Jones For more than five decades, L.Q. Jones was a familiar supporting character actor in more than 150 films and television shows. The American character actor passed away on July 9th at the age of 94, Rebecca Balding. American actress Rebecca Balding, best known for her roles on TV series Soap and the original Charmed, passed away on July 18th. She was 73, Torian Black.
American actor Terrian Black, best known for his role as Detective Neil Washington on NBC's influential 1980s hit police series, Hill Street Blues, died on July 21st. He was 94. Paul Sorvino. American actor Paul Sorvino carved out a five-decade acting career, appearing in more than a hundred films, television series, and plays. Paul Sorvino was best known for his role as Pauly Cicero in Goodfellas. He passed away on July 25th at the age of 83. Tony Dow Tony Dow, the actor who found fame on the U.S. sitcom Leave It to Beaver, died on July 27th at the age of 77. Mary Alice Emmy and Tony-winning actress Mary Alice played Letitia Bostick in A Different World and Effie Williams in the 1967 musical Sparkle. She died on July 27th at the age of 85. Nichelle Nichols American actress Nichelle Nichols, who captivated television audiences as Nyota Ufura in the original Star Trek series, died on July 30th at the age of 89. Pat Carroll Pat Carroll, a comedic television mainstay for decades and the voice of Ursula in The Little Mermaid, died on July 30th at the age of 95. Clue Gulliger Character actor Clue Gulliger was best known for roles on TV's The Virginian and in films such as Return of the Living Dead and The Last Picture Show. Clue Gulliger passed away on August 5th at age 93. Roger E. Mosley American actor Roger E. Mosley, who played helicopter pilot Theodore Calvin on the hit series Magnum P.I., passed away on August 5th at the age of 83. Richard Rote American actor Richard Rote, who amassed an impressive list of credits, appearing in dozens of iconic television shows from the early 60s to the mid-2000s, died on August 5th at age 89. Anne H. American actress, director, and screenwriter Anne H. came to mainstream prominence in the late 1990s with roles in the crime drama film Donnie Brasco, the slasher film I Know What You Did Last Summer, and the drama thriller film Return to Paradise. She passed away on August 12th at age 53. Denise Dowes American actress Denise Dowes, best known for playing the vice principal on the U.S. teen drama Beverly Hills 90210, passed away on August 13th. She was 64. Joe E. Tata American actor Joe E. Tata, who portrayed Nat on all 10 seasons of the original Beverly Hills 90210 died on August 25th at age 85. People come and go. It's just the way it is. But these actors left their mark on the entertainment industry. They will forever be remembered with the many movies, films, and TV shows they appeared in. Fans will always think of them as their characters, and they will always be remembered. See you in the next video.